functional right now. As we can tell, I couldn't figure out how to finish finish that sentence. Um, but hi, how's it going? How are we doing? I overslept this morning because my alarm didn't go off, so that was fun. Um, work was hectic. There was a lot that was going on, but we managed it and we got through it. And I don't know what I've done for the rest of the day. I did laundry. I started laundry. Doing laundry. <sighs> so barely functional team. Um, I'm sorry that you are also barely functional, but stand with you. <laughs> um, aside, aside from being barely functional, how are you doing? Uh, <laughs> I, I'm sure, I'm sure that's exactly it, Legis. Hi, friend. <laughs> Maybe they just wanted to double fist that coffee. Um, yeah, we're gonna play Prey today. I'm very excited about this. I have only seen a little bit about it. Um, I know basic gist of it, but I've only seen a little bit of gameplay. And this is just one that kind of fell under my radar. I saw it, was interested in it, and then just never picked it up. But we're doing it now. Hey! <laughs> um, I'm very excited about it. Yeah. <gasps> you got this, Sam. You're gonna you're gonna knock this email out of the park. You're gonna get it done. And then you're gonna go home and it's gonna be great. And it's gonna be fantastic. And you're gonna do a great job, okay? Okay? <laughs> you're so close. Um but yeah, we're gonna play Prey today. And I'm very excited about that. <laughs> Retroactively recommend it. Look, the more people that recommend it, the more the more excited I am to play it. So many people have told me that I need to play it. Um and I wanted to, I just hadn't had a chance to until now. So we're here and we're doing it. And I'm excited and I'm ready. Um ready enough that I think I'm gonna I think we're just gonna hop right on in. I think we're just gonna like do the thing, you know? Um, hopefully sound and everything is fine. I messed with it a little bit beforehand, but as per usual, just because I've done that doesn't mean it's fine. Um, but we're gonna do it. Hi, Ami. How is it going? What is this? Not survival mode options. <laughs> we're not gonna mess with any of those. We're just doing normal difficulty. <gasps> Do I get to choose me? I would like to be lady, please. Let me be lady. I'll wake up in your apartment in the year 2032. That's like no time from now. How's it going, Emmy? How are you doing? How are you doing? Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. I'm going to need to turn the voices down a little bit. That seems incredibly loud. Hold on a second. Uh, I had the voices up higher than everything else because they are usually so much more quiet than everything. But apparently, <laughs> they know what they're doing. Let me turn those down just a touch. Look at this dang apartment. Hey, Morgan. Wake up. You're burning daylight. That's still said the helicopter loud. to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. See you soon. Oh, listen. Uh, really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. Oh, this like is old weird. times. Okay, hold on a second. Does this work? with a controller. Possibly? I didn't know that the buttons were going to be all funky, but here we are. Controls. Controller? Hmm. Hmm. My controller is plugged in. Fun fact. What if I plug it back in? thinking about it 
Epic says no, no controller for me. Okay, that's fine. Excerpt from Architects of the Neurological Revolution. What if I told you I could turn you into a mathematician on the level of Einstein in under 10 minutes? I'd say you're full of it. That's the first thought that crosses my mind, but it withers in the face of Alex Yu's conviction. Despite myself, I'm riveted. He's not bullshitting me. Himself? Maybe. Me? No. Alex leans back in his chair. Welcome to the age of the Neuromod. Great. Um... I don't know that I want to, like, read all of these. Books, maybe not. Notes, we'll definitely read, but... Take those. I'm sorry, I can climb on my counter? That's just a jump game. That's not climbing, that's just jumping. <laughs> this is fine. <gasps> we will be making a mess of our apartment. Immediately. That throw is very good. Fwah! Very powerful. Enter my password. Emails? Oh, this is weird. Hello, Morgan. So glad to hear you'll be coming aboard soon. Your first official work day is Monday, March 15th. But, uh, but first, we have a series of training exercises we run with all new employees. Just some stuff to clear you for life in orbit. Exciting times ahead. Have a good flight, and I'll see you soon. Thomas Tucker, Human Resources, Talos One Research Facility. Officially welcome here, Emmy. How are you doing? How's it going? Uh, hey, I sent a package with everything you'll need for your first day. Uniform, transcribe, and a neuromod. Sell them your Neuromod right away as we'll be running some tests first thing in the morning. Just follow the instructions. I'll be in touch. Alex. If it gets... <laughs> it's reading email simulator. Let's go. Um, Hey, I just got off the phone with mom and dad. They won't be there when the shuttle departs. They're in New York. Company stuff. But they send their best. I think mom's a little disturbed that both her children are going to be outside her gravitational pull at the same time. Uh, she said you'd better behave and do everything your big brother says. Okay, actually, she said the opposite. I'm supposed to behave and do what you tell me. So, there you go. That's mom. Anyway, everyone's excited about your ideas up there, so get ready. I'll probably call you in the morning to make sure you're up. See you very, very soon. Uh, see you very, very soon, Morgan. Alex. <gasps> Hi, Jesse. <laughs> it's just this... These are, these are nice emails. It's fine. I would rather deal with emails than phone calls. Personally. How is everyone doing this fine Monday? It is Monday, right? Yes. Yes, it is Monday. I just want to throw more things. Let me throw all of the things. Get out of here, shoe. Get out of here, box! Fuck you, shoe! <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's all fine. Alright? Neuromod application instructions. I do need this. Warning, Neuromod should only be administered by certified trans star technicians under controlled conditions. Subject may experience slight discomfort, swelling, or redness of the eye after shortly afterward. Remove Neuromod from vacuum-sealed container. Press rubberized eye cup firmly against bony orbit of eye socket. Keep eye open. To press orange release trigger and continue to hold Neuromod against eye for five minutes. Dispose of used Neuromod in provided biohazard bag. <laughs> um. Aww. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad I could make you happy. <laughs> Just so you could hear my dang voice. Yeah, shoe, yoke, box, yeeted. It's great. Everything's great. But yeah, all our friends are here, and everything is great. And I love my friends. Hey, I love my friends. Um. <gasps> oh, no! Well, at least you have it officially set now. 
is this? Woof. Woof, though. I don't actually want to read these, but I do want to, like, add them. What is this? What is this? No, this is more books. Consider that there are billions of stars in the galaxy like our sun, many of them far older. Some of these stars will have Earth-like planets. Some of these planets may have developed intelligent life. Some intelligent life may develop interstellar travel. If a civilization began before ours, it seems possible, even probable, that even at the speed of currently envisioned interstellar travel, they could already have the entire galaxy colonized. The problem is, we haven't detected any such civilizations, nor have any contacted us. Why? Because we're garbage. <gasps> Video games! Sorry. <laughs> I should go to work. Wanna. Yeah. Ho hopefully it's not it's not too bad. Let me in. Let me in. Mommy is you. Hi, you're so loud. I'm gonna turn the volume on the speech down to match everything else. Um Heard there's a chopper on the roof. Must be for you. Why are you yelling at me? <laughs> why are, Why is everyone so loud? Oh my god. Take me to the roof. Let's go. Right inside voices, please. Look, I know I'm loud, but I'm me. <laughs> no one else can yell. Just me out of here. Alright, we can't all be loud. I have filled the quota for loud people. Just me. Miss also. you. Please make yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. Transstar facility is just a short hop. 78 degrees. I'm Clear so skies sorry. all the way. <laughs> Not the only speaks and yell. Also, is the in-game sound okay for you guys? I can just turn it down for me if I need to. It just seems very loud. <laughs> That's a nice view on the bay there. Sounds alright to you? Good, good, good. Right, they don't need to talk in all caps. Not at all. I'll just turn it down for myself, then. <laughs> Don't have an issue doing that. I just want to make sure it's not, like, blasting y'all out of here as well. <laughs> you know how it is. <gasps> Title. Um. <laughs> oh. Here we are, Ms. Yu. Mind the glass on the way out. <laughs> right. Good luck to you. <laughs> Seems like an odd, odd design choice, but you know what? Gets a point across. <laughs> oh, it's a cool, it's a cool way to do an intro. I like it. Hello, Doctor Yu. Robot, you are very quiet. I'm a civil four nine five science class operator. O okay. Everyone's what does that mean? Eager to see what you're capable of, Doctor Yu. I know I am. Okay, cool, great. Welcome, gonna... Morgan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. Please confirm. <laughs> Sometimes things talk to me. Sometimes random objects just talk to me. That's fine and normal, I guess. Morgan, finally. Everyone is so goddamn loud. Um. <gasps> you got this, Sam. Go home. Get out of there. The roof is telling me I'm prey and I'm concerned. Eh, eh. <laughs> eh. I'm not that worried. Also, hi, Fruity. It's prey. It's prey time. 
Hi. Hey, you don't look terrible in a trans star uniform. We got so How's very close. Still red? I know the test might seem a little... Okay, hold on. Even with everything being turned down, the voices are still so loud. It's like... <laughs> it's like he's like, come up right to my ear. And it's talking at normal volume, but it's right in my ear. Unconventional, but that's, that's a still you so family loud. tradition. Breaking convention Holy is Holy shit. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good. I'm I'm sorry. I'm I'm trying to fix this. <laughs> He's just it's not just me, right? He's really loud for all of you too. It has. That we'll hasn't changed anything. I promise. Mr. Yu? They're ready for your sister in room A. Right. Listen. It's a gay bee. Just be yourself. <laughs> I'll see you after. Okay, bye. <laughs> bye. Or a fest festive Christmas potato. Good morning, Morgan. I'm Dr. Bellamy. I'm not allowed Looks to like push the button yet. like we have some tests to run through today. Probably not the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. All good? Okay. Okay. Great. Let's begin. For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Okay. I'm ready. Wonderful. I've played Portal. I know how to do these things. Oh. Let's go! Wonderful. <laughs> that... You're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B, then. Are we? Are we fine? Imagine getting a test subject in, and the first thing they do is just start jumping around the room. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time. Relax. Think it over. No, I'm kidding. You only have nine seconds. Hit the red button when you're ready to start. Uh, uh, uh. <gasps> That's cute. <laughs> A potion. Uh, uh, you can't. How do I crouch? Morgan, we can see you there. Hmm. Uh, any synaptic register? <laughs> no. I tried. Also, C is crouch, and I hate that. So we're gonna we're gonna change that real fast. Where is wait, I saw it. <laughs> Sneak. Okay, that's better. No. There we go. No, that's fine. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. You're doing marvelous. Why do I feel like I'm failing their tests? Chair is coming with me. All right. Here we go. Just For a this touch. Test, please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most natural, intuitive way possible. <laughs> without thinking. Just just go for it. Press the red button when you're ready. I did it! I did sorry, it! I did it so fast! Please explain to me what's happening. Simmons? I no, I pushed exactly the button! What Tina brought down. Did you double check? Speaker's still on. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Not your fault. You're doing fabulous, actually. One last room. Let's step into D. I pushed those buttons so dang good, I don't know why they're mad at me. <laughs> Listen, I did it great, okay? Listen, Cher and me, we got this. I would appreciate it. No, Thank Cher, you. you're stuck. Cher, oh god, Cher, okay, I'm Morgan, sorry. Have a seat at the table for me, please. Oh, Cher! Ugh! Free my chair. Get my 
my chair out of here. Oh, what is this? Oh, no. Chair. Chair, please. Chair, please, there's room. Chair, please, there's room. I'm sorry, chair. Oh, no. Sad. Wonderful job. I miss chair. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. I'm pressing. If you're planning a vacation, go somewhere familiar you know you love, or try something new. Whenever you're ready, Morgan. I'm, I'm reading! Let's go somewhere familiar. Good. Looks like you've got the hang of it. Keep going. You've been sentenced to death for your actions. How does this make you feel? <laughs> Afraid I don't know what will happen. Angry. No one has that right. Calm. It was worth it. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. <laughs> A runaway train is bearing down on five people who are tied to the track. You can cause the train to switch tracks, but there is one person tied to the second track. All right. Natural questions. <laughs> Just typical stuff. Uh, if I, you can cause the train to switch tracks. We switch tracks. Good. Next. A runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're standing on the platform next to an enormously fat man. Pushing him into the track would stop the train. Almost done. I'm sure he would understand. A runaway train is bearing down on five people tied to the track. You could stop the train by jumping onto the track, but you would die. You push the man. You know what? I'd probably do the same thing. Can I change well my done. answer? Well done. Well done. We're nearly through it. Oh. For this next part, I'm Gosh, going to display an image. I want you to take a good so look go at back it. And finish off In the a moment, witnesses. I'm going to ask you what... <laughs> To him for being a patronizing fat phobic piece of shit. Alex. Simmons, what's going you know. on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? <laughs> She's alive. Sedated. Also, yeah, why would Mug Bring do this? I'm on my way. Horrible. Horrible. Terrible mug. It's okay. Man juice would never do that to me. Good morning, Morgan. I love you. Today Man is juice. Monday, March 15th, 2032. It's not though. Alarm clock. How many times have we done this? Chair. Chair is gonna come back and beat everyone up and it's gonna be great. Also, do I still have things in my inventory? Also, I believe that alarm clock is in on it. Again, alarm clock didn't wake me up this morning, as it was supposed to. So, I don't know that I trust alarm clock. <laughs> gip, 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 gip. I don't know that it's important for me to be doing this. Let's go. Wow, it's... Almost like we've done this already. Fish is still okay. So, you know. There's that. Oh, they got got! Hello, Morgan. It's time we spoke. My code name is January. Hi, January. You're not dreaming. What happened yesterday was real. If you want to know what's going on, first, you need to get out of your apartment building. Okay, You're but I can't? Safe. 
Okay. Oh. I have a stamina bar. Her noises, though. They do take nap right there. Oh, what's this? Hold on. My code name Good. is January. What happened yesterday was real. <laughs> I'll keep in contact. Thank you, Emmy, for the bits. And also, <sighs> Kimrold would be in on it. Audio events. Preferred test run program for tummy of audio events. Oh, pigeon visuals have been disabled due to a glitch in the render data. Hey, Morgan. Wake up. <gasps> You're burning daylight. I said the helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. See you soon. Oh, listen. Uh, really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. It was all, like it was old all times. a lie. Oh, oh, it's it's okay. <laughs> what does that look like, though? What do the pigeons look like? It doesn't matter. Okay, this is fine. <gasps> Do you have a specific voice mod you would like? I still need to make a list of all those. Should be up and running, though. If not, I can hit random and we can just pull pull one out. What would you like? Would you like? <gasps> just random whatever? Alrighty. Alrighty. Where's my random button? There it is. We got speech of speech of fire. How's that sound? How's this? This is a this is a thing. Hello? I don't <laughs> like it when the music starts picking up. Um, I'm gonna turn the five minutes on. Megaphone cage. Is it horrible? If it's, if it's horrible, I can change it. Am I just really loud? I can talk quieter if it's gonna make me loud. It does look like it's peaking a lot. <laughs> I'm gonna turn the five the timer on though. Timer's on now. Can't do nothing about it. Timer is on now. Can I go anywhere? Hello? Hello? No password found. Does it automatically... I don't know what that says. Also, what is this noise? No one will ever know I'm here. Also, chair. No one will ever know I'm here. Even with... Even with a big, loud voice. Don't worry about it. What is... What are these numbers? A lot of... Slamming going on over here. Hello? What does this say? Manufacturing order number 653892. Marco Simmons. Finding this entire skew is defective. Investigate with fabrication. Marco. Password. We got it. We got it. Password. Got it. Not announce nothing. Can't prove anything. Oops. Keep attacking the screens. This is fine. Uh, reminder about company password policy. This is just a friendly reminder from the relevant portion of the policy handbook. Uh, I keep hitting the wrong button. Uh, 2.7 password protection. Do not share your password with anyone. Passwords are sensitive confidential information. Passwords must not be inserted into email messages, transcribed conversations, or other forms of communication. Do not write down passwords and store them anywhere in your office. If you suspect your password has been compromised, report it to IT immediately. Users will be held responsible for any activity that occurs on a workstation that has been compromised and not reported. <laughs> Hi. I Hello. This is Keisha speaking. I'm here to give you your daily reports and announcements. A note about this morning. Oh, I know this morning's incident has left people shaking. To prevent unnecessary panic, please refrain from contacting people outside of your department. 
A station-wide announcement will be made shortly. In the meantime, Miss Elazar and her security team are on high alert and will field any requests you have. I know some of you are worried about Dr. Be uh, Bellamy. He's currently being treated in the trauma center and is in critical but stable condition. Thank you for your patience and dedication to this project. Alex Yu. Recorded <laughs> repeated every five minutes. Okay. All right. Bad install? Simmons, the test results today were all negative. Did you install the correct neural mods? Touch base with Gra uh, Graves and figure out what went wrong. This should be your absolute highest priority. We'll do it. Don't think I won't do it. We'll freaking do it. Here. What does this code say? What does this code say? I can't read this code. That's not enough information for me to understand. Diploma. Get out of here. I want it. this. I want it. what's in the safe. Why can't I get into the safe? It's sad. <laughs> um. Well, the Hephaestus Heffy Twist and Loop Handle Wrench is standard issue for all maintenance personnel employed in Transstar, uh, Transstar facilities. Good for liberal application of percussive maintenance and mechanical agitation. Yeah, no, game, I've been, uh, I've been hitting things a lot already. In case you didn't know, I've been swinging like a mad woman. Let's go. Where's this, where's this go? Hello? <sighs> it's my fake apartment! Mm -hmm. Give me that. Hello? <laughs> Not a fake helicopter. It's broken? Hello? <laughs> can ever locate me. I am in the wires. Do not hang up. If you hang up, I will be gone. <laughs> also, hi, Travis. You're just in time for the voice mod to be done. Um, what if I told you I could turn you into a mathematician? Wait, I read this. That has been read. Can I go this way? Ah! Plasmus. Everyone calls them mimics. Be careful what you pick up. Chair, please! Oh, I've been betrayed by chair. Oh! Oh! Oh, I'm so sorry, chair. I didn't mean to get you stuck. But I did. Oh, is there glass here? Am I... Maybe I shouldn't walk on that. That you right, chair, I'm your friend. I saw you. Take the mimic tumor? Necropsy required. <laughs> Oops, all mimics. Uh okay, what is this? Switching scene in progress. Oh I see. Oh I see. Wild. 
Is there a roof? Yeah, I'm scared. Oh, there's a body here. It's Gret Mickelson. Give me your apple. Okay, well, what's this then? Okay, well, <laughs> this seems like a lot of work for something. I'm concerned. <laughs> I am concerned. <gasps> Hi, Cyril! <laughs> wasn't even the mimic that scared me! It was just man! Why is it growing more lit? No one has been able to stop the mimics from multiplying since they broke containment. I'm going to help you stay alive. Just a little further. That's because no one will stop getting eaten by them! Oh, this is horrible. How's it going, Cyril? How are you doing? Ugh. Take. I'm scared. <laughs> Remote manipulation. Computer. Maximum entangled state. What? That's what that said. Okay. <gasps> nice! Right? Listen, if everyone could stop getting eaten by mimics for just, just a second. <laughs> Announcement! I need everyone in the building to stop getting eaten by mimics for a hot second while we try and get this situation under control. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, what is this? Joven! <laughs> it's just my hand! Also, I'm doing good, Zero. Uh it's been a it's been a long Monday already. But we, we got through it. Oh no, no, no yawns. Why would they be my hands? Emmy! <laughs> Emmy! <laughs> These are my hands. My hands are right here. <laughs> Surprise, I'm playing this in VR? You just you just didn't know. Alright, you'll need the room updated to uh, the new test plan. Configurations are as follows. Room A, area of effect. Room B, copycat. Room C, spooky action. Simmons, let us know if anything changes. The hell is it? A note about this morning. No, the morning. Wait, we read this one. Urgent. Oh, it'll mark which ones I haven't read. Okay, that makes sense. I understand. Hey, I think Bellamy's taken data related to mimicry and remote manipulation out of the research department. Get to the trauma center and grab the key card to his cabin off his body. Sorry to be morbid, but Alex will lose his shit if someone else finds that data. Marco Simmons. So he's not stable. Well, I get. I guess his condition is stable if he's dead. Oh! Listen. Experiment with different approaches to overcome challenges and enemies. You can get past the locked door by searching for the key card, finding an alternate path. As you learn new abilities, more options will become available to you. That's cool. Every time it brings up one of those notices, though, I panic. Hello? Because uh, I keep thinking that the lights have gone out. <gasps> I can do a stretch. Y'all do a stretch with me, please. Big stretch. Oh, God. Okay. Thank you, Cyril. Oh, okay. <gasps> I want to keep this. I like this. I like it. Eyeballs. Hello. Chair, you're not too mad at me, are you? For getting, for getting you stuck earlier? Okay, I can't. 
Access that computer. <gasps> Simulation question. I'm standing. Chair. Chair. Ah! <laughs> this is mean. <laughs> Happens right as Rudy mentions it. This is terrible. <laughs> I just want to pick up objects and throw them. Holy shit. Hey, Alice. I'll send you the white paper Alex and Morgan wrote. Here's the nutshell version for now. Gaining a new skill from a neuromod works similar to the way our, your brain creates new memories. In fact, it's impossible for now to separate the changes the mod makes from normal memory formation. So if I want to strip the neuromod that makes you play piano like Gustav Littner, you'll all, it'll reset your brain back to the moment before you first installed it. You wanted Morgan's mind pristine to... Oops. Receive... The prototype neuromods. That means going way the hell back. Hence the apartment sim. Uh, user dedicated to their science is all I can say. Uh, hit me up for lunch later. Simmons. Search. Mimic? Are you here? Oh. Hey! <laughs> Go away! Stop! <laughs> I gotta give myself a fucking heart attack! Stop! <sighs> Surprise attack on mimicked object! Oh god! This is fine. <laughs> this is too many! Okay, this is fine. Hello? Where is it? Where'd he go? Ah. Oh, they're so fast and I'm so slow. <laughs> okay, it's fine. We got it. <laughs> I do need going hunter's powers. You right? You right? Okay, I have to go back and get the key card from man's body. He what? Open. <laughs> Does this hurt me? No. No fall damage. Great. Also, I'm like half health. At half health. How do I... I don't know what that did. E? It is E. Oh my gosh. Where is it? <laughs> ah! I see you! Come back! Where is it gone? Okay, well, observation should be this way. That's the apartment. Where's this? Okay, it's fine. That... Sorry, I'm already lost. It's fine. Maybe we just wander around for a bit. I wanted to find... Bellamy's... Body. Which they said was gonna be in a different place. Okay, that's fine. Hello? Oh. Pop! Pop! Okay, 
We're getting good at bopping. <laughs> this is fine. Don't even worry about it. It's very dark over here, though. Which does feel like a, a thing to be worried about. I've just walked around in a circle, haven't I? Yeah. Okay. That's okay. We can... Go up? Whoa! Wait. <laughs> Something tells me that this is not... The way, oh, it's not the way that they want me to do it, but you know, that's fine. Through here? This leads us back towards the apartment. That's the fake elevator. There we go. Okay. Okay. No, it's not real. I know it's not real. Great. <laughs> this is fine. So then... Maybe it's not fine. I've already seen all this, haven't I? <laughs> what if I just break their entire facility, actually? I should probably be focusing more on doing things as opposed to just wrecking things. But it's fun! Um. <laughs> please don't please don't give yourself an allergic reaction to stuff I'm glad it was tasty be careful that's there's nothing there hmm <laughs> There was a door here. But now I'm now it's missing. Am I an idiot? How did I get where I was before? Everything looks different. Everything's different now. here somewhere. I just had to break more things, that's all. Okay, well this is kind of where he died, isn't it? But where did they move his body? You know what? Doesn't matter. They did tell me that there was a second place to go, so let's go there instead. Um... <laughs> Oh, to, to have your own nice apartment. Imagine. <gasps> Love it. Okay. Here we go. I'm scared. I don't want to be in here. Oh! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, and I can't back up very fast. Can I stand up in here? I can. Well, that's fine. Now we know. You don't see me, you don't see me, you don't see me. That was a phantom. 
Typhon Anthrophantasmus. Keep moving. Okay, but what's this? Any objects in Talos 1 can be repaired if you have the repair skill and enough spare parts. Okay, well, I don't. Thank you, Veer. What is this? Glue cannon? Transstar glue cannon? Jelliform lattice organism ob obstructor? Disables and or immobilizes targets without harming them. Glue can ex extinguish flames and temporarily stop electric arcs. When hardened, glue can be used as a climbable platform. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. I'm here for goop gun. No, oh, I missed. There, in the foyer. Grab the neural mod you see in the display case. I'm very Normally bad at a aiming. Fake, but I swapped in a real one for you. The neural mods are critical. You won't survive without using okay. them to install no, I... your aptitudes. I have died. <laughs> load, load, it's fine. We're just, we're just, we've got no one has been able to stop the mimics from multiplying since they broke oh, containment. No. I'm going to help you stay alive. This is so far ago. Okay, it's fine. Further. I've never said I've been, I'm good at, at shooting gun. Listen. It's okay, we won't blow ourselves up this time. It's fine. It's all fine. Nope. You don't know I'm here. You don't know I'm here. You don't know I'm here. <laughs> Give me glue gun. That was a phantom. Spoopy gloopin. Keep moving. Okay. This is fine. <laughs> Morgan, there, in the foyer. Grab the neural mod you see in the display case. Normally it's a fake, uh, but I swapped in a real one for you. The neural mods are critical. Where is it gone? It's so dark. To install new aptitudes. January, I need you to I've shut up for a minute. Your transcribe with the list you requested. Take a look. Ma'am, <laughs> I'm being attacked. Okay. I didn't mean to carry that. There's nothing in there. Get out of here. Neuromod in the- in the- in- where? There. Let's go. Shove that shit into my eyeballs. Hey! Okay, what are we doing? Scientists use knowledge of science, medicine, and specialized lab equipment to your advantage. Specialize in modifying your gear, repairing, or crushing problems with your wrench. Boost your physical ability, skill, firearms, and security tactics. I kind of want to just smash things. <laughs> what does this do? Fix broken grav shafts, fabricators, and recyclers with spare parts. Lift heavy objects! That could be useful. I run across a bunch of things that I cannot pick up. What is this? Increase your health and your stamina! Okay, maybe we do that first. <laughs> oh, that's terrifying! Don't shove that in your face. Oh, jeez. I'm sure there are many Transtar personnel who wish they had stronger, faster bodies at the moment. Now, let's get you to the main lobby. I want to get back there. Do we... Do we revisit areas? 
Hey, no, come here. No, I hit you. No, I've hit you. No, I've hit you. Listen, Mimic! Mimic, I was hitting you! <gasps> Hi, stars! Where is it? Where is it gone? Did it go through there? Terrible. <laughs> they get increasingly horrible! Fantastic! You love to see it. Alright, Mimic got... Now that I kind of know what to look for, it's not as bad. Yeah, favorites wheel. I've, I've looked at it. Yes? Well, maybe not yet? I don't think there's, like, really anything else for me to do here. Wait. Wait, can I... Where are you going? <laughs> Morgan, I need you to not make the noises you're making. I was hoping that maybe I could glue this and it would <laughs> yeah, it moved a tiny little teensy beansy bit. Not enough. It, like, keeps bouncing elsewhere, which is not super helpful. Oh, gosh. And these controls are a little funky. <gasps> right? Ma'am. <laughs> Might exit out and then reconnect my controller and see if it works. Because even with my mouse, I'm not necessarily, like, swinging around as fast as I would like to. And so maybe, maybe a controller would be better. <laughs> it has just saved. Okay, maybe we actually do this. Now would be a good time to do this. Anyway, so, you know. Hold on, I'm saving the game. You're not missing anything. It did just save, but I'm going to save more. Save. Create save. <laughs> save. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna quit the desktop. I'm gonna re re-plug in my controller. We're gonna see about using that. Tried to do that earlier, but it was like, mm -mm. no, I don't think so. And that was kind of a butthole move on its part. Um. <gasps> Burb. Burb would like to hang out with me. Bird says, I live here now. <laughs> they really do. Okay. Um. <laughs> I was gonna say I have a I have a red house finch that like keeps hanging out on my window where my planter is. And it likes to come up and, and just sing at me. <laughs> I like house finches. Maybe. I don't know. It's mostly just stealing all of the uh the like coconut fibers that I have at the bottom of the, the planter taking him elsewhere but it likes to sit on the planter and and sing to me that way okay can you it is hold on I have a controller it was connected, and now it's being like, no. 
Hi, David. Sorry, I'm trying to. I just want. I just want Epic to recognize my controller. That's all. Listen, I have a controller. It was plugged in. It wasn't getting recognized, so maybe if I connect it like this. It's just my PlayStation controller. It works. It works with Steam. Don't have any other issues with it anywhere else. I had it hardwired in. I'm going to try and just do a Bluetooth connection real fast. Come on. Please? No, everything says no. Nothing wants to work for me. This is horrible. <laughs> I've never had to use my controller with Epic, though, so, like... Hold on. Maybe if I... Exit out of Steam. Then plug it in. Sorry, y'all are gonna have to wait while I troubleshoot this, because I think I would much rather play with this game with a controller than than with my keyboard. It's not terrible with a keyboard, but it would just be nicer uh, without it. Okay, it's on a hot second. Great. Great. Plugged in. Epic, I need you to do a, I need you to do a thing, okay? Hmm. <laughs> and like the game recognizes or like says that it's got controller compatibility. So Let me, I'm gonna put some music on, uh, and I'm gonna move us over to the BRB screen. Y'all can do some, some words on stream while I try and mess with this a little bit, if you want. <laughs> uh, if I can't figure this out in the next, like, couple of minutes, then I'll just keep doing, using my, my keyboard, but, yeah. <laughs>
I think I might have I think I might have figured it out <laughs> we're having to do some real funky workarounds but I think I got it um I'm gonna <laughs> I have to change change some, some some things real fast um but it appears to work so that's exciting <laughs> um hey epic game launcher kind of fucking sucks in case you were wondering uh but even if you weren't it's horrible we do so here is the thing we do have to start over given the fix that I've done hope oh. Hopefully y'all are fine with that. We should be able to catch up real fast because I know what I'm doing this time. Um, <laughs> we're really not losing that much progress, all things considered. Uh, but oh, and I do need to swap some things real around real fast. still being kind of a butthole. Okay. There we go. Um. But. I can. I can. I can use a controller now. Which is very nice. <laughs> Hello stars. I hydrated during. During the break. But I'll do it. Do a little sip for you. Thank you for redeeming that. You could say you've been lurking. It's true. It's true. Um, so yeah, like I said, we do need to like restart the game, unfortunately. <laughs> we have lost an hour's worth of progress, but you know, it's okay. We can, I think we can catch up real fast. Um, this will be much nicer having controller support now. I'm sorry I didn't do this before. I didn't know that Epic just does not have controller support. <laughs> so here we are. Um, Good morning, Morgan. Today okay. is Monday, March 15th, I... 2032. Can't skip. That's okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, thanks for hanging in there while we try and figure this out. This will be much nicer. Let's go. Hey, Morgan. Wake up. You're burning daylight. I sent the helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Ooh. Don't forget to wear your suit. See Ooh. you soon. Oh, listen. It is dumb and uh, gross. It's very really dumb and gross of Epic. Come on board. We're going. Um... I do want to increase the sensitivity just a little bit, though. Not camera, Bob. Sensitivity go up. Like there. Let's shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. That's... Probably a little, a little whippy for y'all. Turn it down just a smidge. <laughs> Again, thank you for hanging in there while I try and sort this out. I'm sorry that it's being such a butthole. Options. Where was, it said always, yeah, yeah, yeah. Always give me the controller prompts. That's better. Okay. Great. It's fine, we can get get through this a little faster so like i said i know where to go and i know what to do and i'm not just puttering around anymore um all right morning is you heard there's a chopper on the roof must Everyone's, be for you everyone is so loud <gasps> i can 
can slide? I can slide? This is incredibly exciting. I am a little sad because I don't think I'm going to be getting any achievements for this since I <laughs> technically had to port the game through Steam. But uh, that's fine. We'll just pretend I'm getting all of these. Ms. Yu, please make yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. Transtar facility is just a short hop. 78 degrees, clear skies all the way. No, it's not. None of this is real. Um. Yeah. <laughs> this is acceptable. I'll take a sticker. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's not that big of a deal. Um. I That's a nice that there view was, on the bay there. Wish there was controller support through Epic. Please and thank you. Alas, it's fine. Um, so it's a bit of a rough start for this, but that's okay. <laughs> We'll just get to see everything happen again, but a little faster. I can't complain too much, though. Prey was, like, the free game on the Epic Store uh, a couple weeks back. Last month, I think. Um, and so, like, I didn't have to pay for this, technically. Here we are, Ms. Yu. <laughs> Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. So, it's... Fine. I'm just very excited to play it. I like it so far. Hey, Internet, do you want to be stable for a minute? Hey, Internet. Hello, Dr. Yu. I'm a Bye. 495 science class operator. Everyone yeah. is eager to see what you're capable of, Dr. Yu. I know I am. Our research often requires intense focus Welcome, long hours. Morgan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the it's testing it's facility. Please Everyone confirm. is talking over each other. <laughs> I, need, I need them to not talk over each other. Oh, boy. It's okay. We do get to watch Bellamy get Morgan, destroyed. Finally. Hi. Hey. You don't look terrible hey. in a Transtar uniform. How's your eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a you family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Hey. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good hands. Are we, though? Because we'll be he's kind of like an week. asshole. I promise. Mr. Let's Yu, get ready go. for your sister in room A. Right. Listen, just be yourself. I'll see you after. Okay. It's okay. We can do this right this time and not Good morning, Morgan. get chairs stuck behind the, I'm the, the table. Bellamy. Looks like we have some tests to run through today. Get Probably not the kind of thing fucked. you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. All good? Great. Let's begin. For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. I do appreciate that I can Press jump and still be ready. crouching. How do I pick things up? Okay, this is fine. Wonderful. That you're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B then. Listen, I just had to figure out what the buttons were, sir. <gasps> Chair. <gasps> Chair. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time. Relax. Think it over. 
No, I'm kidding. You only have nine seconds. Hit the red button when you're ready to start. Can't see me. Can't see me. Hmm. Uh, any synaptic register at all? No? Oh, that's fine. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. You're doing marvelous. I get, I get so excited about chair being here that I pick it up before I can hide behind it. But it's okay. We have chair now. You can see their chair. All right. Here We're we go. We're still full of For energy. Test, I just got to jump. Please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most jump, natural, intuitive way possible without thinking. Just just go for it. I would like to press know the what they're seeing me ready. doing. Cuz like Clearly something is different. I'm sorry, can someone please explain to me what's happening? Simmons? I installed exactly what Tina brought down. Did you double check? Speaker still on. I apologize, Morgan. We're okay. having some trouble with the equipment. Not your no, fault. No, you can You're you can say it's me. Actually. You can say it's a me One issue. That's scene. fine. Let's step into D. You can tell me that it's a me issue. I'll understand. I would love to step into the next room, if you would let me. Okay. Chair, you stay right there. Don't move, Can chair. Can a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. Wonderful job. I want to keep Take an eye on that the mug. In front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. Planning vacation, let's go. Somewhere familiar. Good. Looks like you've got the hang of it. Keep I'm not going gonna trap chair, I promise. Been sentenced to death. Calm, it was worth it. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. Switch the tracks. Good. Next. Push the man. Oop. Almost done. We do nothing. Interesting. Well done. Well done. We're nearly through it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look at it. <gasps> In a moment, I'm going to ask you what... Uh, just not talking. This lady saw that thing show up and didn't do nothing about it. Security! Security! Chair! <gasps> they took chair. They took chair from me. They took chair from me. There's chair! Chair came back! <laughs> chair wasn't there, then chair was there. It's fine. Chair came back. Chair wasn't trapped. Alex. Simmons, what's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? It's fine. She's alive, sedated. Clean it up. I'm Ugh. on our way. Let's go. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. None of it's real. I have to put my hair back up a little bit. <laughs> What year is it, actually? I don't think I, like, checked that in any of the emails that we were reading. Not that this would help with that. Danger leap now! Well, that's new! It's from January, though. I do want to grab the items that are here. <laughs> Since I kind of ignored them last time. Just, just real quick. Grab some of the items that are here.
chair. I'd also like to add all of the notes, but you know. That's fine. Alright, let's go. <laughs> I do think for this playthrough, I am just gonna kind of like wander around and try and find as much stuff as possible. Um, so it's gonna be a longer, a longer one. Hello, Morgan. It's time we spoke. My code name is January. You're not dreaming. What happened yesterday was real. <gasps> I have if a flashlight. First, you need to get out of your apartment building. You're not safe. Flashlights. Perfect. Great. Good. You're in the simulation lab. Now get to the exit. I'll keep in contact. I read those. Um, that's where they want me to go. What's over here? Password. Just go through some of that. You want to know what that safe code is and... It's fine. I keep thinking I, like, figure it out, and then I look at it, and I'm like, no, that's not whatever it is that I thought it was is not it. That is incorrect. It's fine. We don't actually need it. Do not enter stage unless in costume. Do not interact with subject off script. Always reset the position of stage props and apartment after each test. The placements or damaged props can be found in the storage area. Be careful not to bump glass wind in observation zones. Okay. Water. Okay. <gasps> the doors. <laughs> Password is user for a a number lock for a number safe. I mean, all right, if you say so. Flashlight. Oh my gosh, this is so much nicer. I get back there? <gasps> no, because it's not real. I don't understand. No, wait, I can. Because I can get back here. <laughs> it's fine. Typhon Cacoplasmus. Everyone calls them <gasps> mimics. Be careful what you pick up. There we go. That mimic doesn't give me anything! Trash. Bad. Horrible mimic. Poor shame. Okay. Look at how much faster we've gotten here. I wonder what you can do if you actually just go do the things. I saw you. Not search. Take. That is fine as is. There's nothing back here. Okay, let's go. Alright, let's go. Again, man scared me. Again, if we could stop getting eaten by the mimics, I think we'd be fine. Bunch of goobers, these scientists, I swear. 
No one has been able to stop the mimics from multiplying since they broke containment. I'm going to help you stay alive. Just a little further. <sighs> Where did they go? Hello? Okay, this is fine. We have read those. So we're not going to worry about them too much. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know this one. Yeah, I'm just kind of trying to grab the things. Oh, I found the key card. Well, that's exciting. Oh, I can harvest all the plants. Mimic, please. Mimic, please. It's for the best if you just die. Alex, I need you- or not Alex. Alex is our brother. Morgan. Morgan, I need you to stop grunting and groaning all the time. You are okay. I promise. Or at least you will be okay. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Great. No oof. No erg. Only do. No sound. That was a phantom. Typhon Anthrophantasmus. Keep moving. Who is January? Give me that glue gun. Give me those canisters. <laughs> Hello, Sunflower Sarah. How's it going? Welcome in. How do I... Oh! That's not the button that I wanted. Hold on. There we go. That's how we switch weapons. I understand. Oh, yeah. Welcome in, Sarah. <laughs> yeah, we're doing pretty good. Playing some playing some spooky game. Fighting some some little little tiny mimics. It's it's a good time. Morgan, there. In the foyer. Grab the neuromod you see in the display case. Normally it's a fake, but yeah. I swapped in a real one for you. The neuromods are critical. Oh I got it! You nice. won't survive without using them to install new aptitudes. I've already updated your transcribe with the list you requested. This is horrible. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. I was trying to get into my... My... Yeah, I was trying to get into my menu to use a health kit, and it didn't work out super well. Um, that's okay. I'm gonna have to get back in here, aren't I? This is horrible. Oh, okay. Not that bad, actually. How do I... I mean, I can do that here. Push and hold triangle. I understand. That was a fantasy. Yeah, like I said, we're doing I well. Skin. Keep moving. Welcome in. Glad that you're doing well as as well. <gasps> oh. Okay. Yeah. No. I, I know we got the glue gun. Don't worry. It's fine. Is there anything behind this? No. All right, let's do this properly. Morgan, there, in the foyer. Grab the neuromod you see in the display case. Normally it's a fake, but I swapped in a real one for you. There we go. The neuromods are critical. <sighs> you won't survive without using them to install <sighs> new aptitudes. Okay. I've already updated your transcribe with the list you requested. This is this is Take too many look. mimics, and I need January to <sighs> stop talking to me, honestly. <sighs> Uh, okay, there we go. Uh! Ah. 
combat is a lot harder with the controller. <laughs> I'm very bad at combat. <laughs> Noted. Okay. This is fine. I'll get used to it. Y'all just gotta suffer for a while while I just do it real bad. Typhon Anthrophantasmus. I need Keep January moving. to stop repeating literally everything, though. Yes, I'm already in the process of shooting, game. Morgan, there. In the foyer. Grab the neuromod you see in the display case. Normally it's a fake, but I swapped in a real one for you. The neuromods are critical. You won't survive without using them to install new aptitudes. I've already updated your transcribe with the list you requested. Take a look. Ah, I just need her to stop talking as much as she is. Ah. Slash. Okay, this is fine. You know what? This is fine. Go ahead and heal. And we'll just run away, actually. How about that? How about we just go? I don't need to kill every single mimic. Break it. Break the thing and take the Neuromod, please. Um... Honestly, if I end up hating it with a controller, I'll swap back to mouse and keyboard. I'll just take tomorrow to remap everything. I thought I would like it better with a controller, though. I'm sure there are many Transtar personnel who wish they had stronger, faster bodies at the moment. Now. Stop! Lobby. <laughs> Stop giving me tutorials while other things are happening. Game, please. Okay, where's the other one? There it is. I need you to not be as wiggly as you are. Please. Slash, if you could not be able to reach me from forever away, that would be cool too. Okay, there we go. We did it! <laughs> Woof. Okay, get me out of here. So yeah, my big issue with the mouse and keyboard is just that the mapping is fucking weird. <laughs> Was bizarre. Hey. You made it. Ready for your first real view of the world? No. Good morning, Talos. All personnel should report That's to their workstation for the world. day. That's not world. That's space. If you space. expect to be absent for any reason, please inform your immediate supervisor. We're in space. I think I'll be less annoyed, too, since we're not replaying stuff. <laughs> um, if I could find more health packs, though, that'd be cool. Why is everything shake? Oh! Careful. You need to get to your office. I've updated your map. There's a video you need to see. I know you have a lot of questions. Okay. Um, can we eat food to recover health? Suit integrity. Integrity could definitely use a little bit of health, but you know, it's fine. Nope. How do I eat? Where have I put this? I have not put it anywhere. I have thrown it on the ground. Let's go ahead and heal up. Attention. Up Station there. leadership has issued an alert. All personnel should report to muster stations immediately and await further instructions. 
Oh, they're so wiggly. This is fine. Mimics? Hello? Get out of here, headphones. That is your You bastards! Yeah, I'm aware, game. <laughs> I, I understand. Uh. Okay, get me out of here, actually. It's bad in there. And we don't want to be there. No, that's too many! Oh, this is horrible. <laughs> we like we like our we like our deadly wrenches. Very good. Whoop. Whoop. Let's not fight all of the mimics at the moment and maybe just get to our office. You know? I don't have a password for that. Ugh. Do appreciate a good wrench. Can I get from here? No matching key card. How about if I do this? I don't think I'm supposed to be here. That's fine. Whoa! That chair. Is a mimic. Alright. We are getting better about spotting them. So that's nice. I'm still just incredibly concerned. <laughs> about everything. Whoa. Okay. Hi boss. Alright, we got him. Oh, no, I wasn't even looking at you! I was looking at the... Looking at this. International Art Talos Edition. The Transstar Corporation commissioned several high profile artists to create works, works exclusively for Talos One, the orbital research and development facility that has brought us the Neuromod and many other technological wonders. Renowned Belgian art, uh, sculptor Frederick Smart uh, sculpted the work Smoke Signals, which forms the centerpiece of the employee dining hall. The installation artist, simply known as Jesse, Constructed the chain of marbled glass panels, which soar gracefully overhead in the Talos One lobby. And former street art artist Patrick O. designed a series of exclusive posters for the Trans Star featuring impressions of orbit, eclipse, and other celestial themes in his signature geometric style. He also developed the Neuromod promotional image featuring the likeness of actor Daisy Prince. Trans Star uh, uh, President Alex Yu commented, Art inspires, fires our creativity, makes us look beyond our present circumstances to what might be possible. Sunflower Sarah, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Glad you're glad you glad you want to stick around. We're happy to have you. Um that's cool stuff. No, stop. <laughs> Listen, I saw you and I was gonna attack you, but I already stepped on you. Ah Everything no! Okay. We'll take these. We'll take that duck beer. <gasps> Wait, there was something in that cabinet. That one. We will be eating every bit of food that we can find. Already read that one. Uh, working on aboard a space station like Talos is comparable to working on Earth. Employees tend to forget that they are in space and adapt very well. By contrast, the trove of psychological and behavioral data has been compiled by a decade-long study of uh, Pythias? Pythias? Pythias employees. The Pythias facility sits deep in a crater on the lunar pole, permanently shadowed and surrounded by kilometers of ice. Beneath Pythias is a vast network of cramped tunnels where helium-3, hydrogen, and platinum are mined. 
This is a dark, cold, and often terrifying workplace, cut off from the warm glow of Earth, which extracts a heavy and often fatal toll on the crew. We're just cool with that? We're just fine with that? Thank you for the stuff, Octavia. Um, <gasps> more food. Uh, I am going to be searching every single cabinet <laughs> for, for uh, things that we can eat. Because, oh boy, do we need it. Steal some agave. Brick. Can I... Oops, that one. Well, it doesn't do anything. Okay, well, it also doesn't help that I'm in the wrong place. I realize. Okay. <laughs> That's capitalism, baby! Yeah. Ah, stop! 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 Terrible! How am I missing? <laughs> Some of those I understood. A lot of them, though... <gasps> I wish I had a Gruber. Give me a Kruber so I can get rid of the cobwebs. Please and thank you. I'm just gonna walk this way so I can steal all of the things. I heard one. Is that a turret? It was. I saw the, the name right as I was saying it. <gasps> Give me that. Love me a good key card. What is this? Volunteer attitude. Miss Goodwin. I'm going to need more support. The volunteers are agitated. More than usual. This morning, Eleven threatened to bash my head and if I didn't let him out to stretch his legs. When you get up here, the key code is 7887. Not the old number on file. I'm pretty sure they've been watching me punch that in, so I changed it. Uh, security officer John Haskins. I know that it keeps all of the, like, computer passwords saved. But does this keep all of these ones saved as well? I assume not. Where is this? I'm just gonna put security. I'm gonna be smart and actually like write something down for this. Seven eight eight seven. And also until I know that it saves it, you know, it's fine. Uh, Doctor Igwe, I relayed your previous requests and we'll see what we can do. Uh, but there are no guarantees. The schedule for the visit is tight and may not allow for a face to face. I'll let you know when I have more details. Sincerely, Bianca. Miss Goodwin, I, uh, to follow up on the previous request, I was wondering if there had been any updates on Gustav Littner's visit. Is it still taking place, or and if so, would it be possible to get a copy of his, of his itinerary? I would love a chance to meet him before the neuromapping procedure, if possible. Right context. Yeah, Iwe showed up, quiet, uh, quiet and polite. He shook Littner's hand like he was afraid of breaking him. Asked him to sign an album he'd brought brought uh Littner seemed flattered so that was a plus tried to make him comfortable his condition was hasn't stopped him from craving a cigarette fingers were twitching it's too bad such a talent no wonder he wanted to get scanned Oop. i haven't really given myself a ton of context i just wrote sec <laughs> and then the number so we'll see if i can make sense of that later on hello turret are we friends started talking and I thought it was getting mad at me. Oh, we like turret. Oh, we like turret. Turret is friend. Okay, I need to find... Target, no alien material detected. 
We gotta find us some stuff. Staff, please move these remaining boxes to my new office and Neuromod Div as soon as feasible. Well, you're not gonna be getting anything anytime soon, buddy. Nature of consciousness remains deeply mysterious. How can the subjective nature of experience, my inner life, be explained in scientific terms? Does consciousness emerge from complex computations among brain neurons? Or is it a fundamental and irreducible property woven into the fabric of the universe? Asking the big questions over here. Sylvan, I'm trusting you with my brain. You do good work, so hopefully that continues. Listen, if the tests don't go well, if something happens, let Alex Coaching know that I know it wasn't 0, 4, his fault. 5, 1. Okay. 0451. January, could you not have told me that when I was at my office? Also, if tests drag on, consider moving your office down to Sim. Less hassle, and you can always move back after we celebrate our success. And also, not when I'm reading things? I get that January is trying to help, but... They're kind of annoying. Oh, it does offer the password. That's nice. Cool. I don't need to write anything down then. And I love that for me. Welcome back. This has been your home for the last three years. The video should be on your workstation. <gasps> Family! Get that out of here. Good morning, Talos. Breakfast is served in the cafeteria until 9 a.m. Okay. Before I look at the video, I do kind of want to just poke around. What is this? That's the wrong button. That's also the wrong button. It's fine. Whatever. Uh, give me those spare parts. Give me all this. <gasps> oh, health pack, please. Anything else I can nab? Morning, Morgan. I got the plan you requested. It's in your safe. Jason. Teleconferencing. Neuromod. Uh, utilities. What do we got here? That's the video we're supposed to watch, but... You made it! Still don't know what happened. I put it behind me. But there's no reason we can't be uh, can't still be civil. You passed me in the hall today and you looked through me. If you're angry at something I did, tell me and we can talk about it. Pretending you don't even know who I am isn't going to help. We still have to work together. Mika. Morgan, has requested your terminal logs are set to be automatically forwarded to your suite and crew quarters. And the supplies from hardware sent up. Let me know if they get to you alright. And if not, I'll get it resolved. Like last week, I'll make sure you aren't disturbed in the interim. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. I'll hold down the fort outside your office. Listen. Let's play. Okay. Main screen. There. Hello, Morgan. Tough day, right? If I'm talking to myself, it must be. Your memory's shot full of holes, I know. I'm sorry, but it's permanent. So the first thing you need to know is you can trust January. It's an operator, a sort of backup of you and me. It knows what you've forgotten. We've been testing a new kind of neuromod based on the Typhon organisms, mapping their neural patterns onto ours. Problem is, when you uninstall a Neuromod, uh, it resets your memory back to the moment you first put it in. Doesn't sound great. That's why you forget. There's supposed to be a process that brings you back up to speed between test runs. But someone could just skip that part. Turn a single day into your entire life. Well, that's exactly what Alex did. Of the course her is, brother would do that. Why? You're not going to like what I have to say next. Excuse me? I was watching that! Just for this. 
found every one of those damn videos. Sorry, but I can't let you listen to that. Not until I've had a chance to explain everything in person. For now, just... Damn it. I have to go. Just sit tight. Please. Mm, no. In Kennedy's second term, the space race reached new heights and without his support may have sputtered completely. Succession of moon launches heralded the coming of an accelerated, energetic space program, both within the halls of government and in the public eye. Unusual at the time, especially in contrast to Kennedy's first term, rather than being simply a race between two powers, the Soviets and the United States seemed to be reaching out to space together. Mm. Sorry, Morgan. Alex cut us off from the Looking Glass servers. Time to improvise. I suggest you search Dr. Calvino's workshop in the hardware labs. He invented the Looking Glass technology. You might find a way to restore the server connections there. I'm looking for another way to help you in the meantime. Good luck. Okay. What is this? <gasps> okay. That's a recycler. Don't need that. Let's go. I thought if I put it down, it would it would open up, but that was not the case. This is tragic. I've been betrayed by my turret friend. There we go. I understand. Get it, turret, get it! Good job, turret. Proud of you. Ah! Get it, turret! It was there! I saw it! <gasps> Pistol! You're doing great, turret! <laughs> I love you, turret. Okay, what do we got in here? Woo! Is there... Okay, we're supposed to go this way. Well, turret's gonna come with us. Because I love turret! Turret's our new friend. Um... Turret is very good. Oof. Get out there, buddy. It's a recycler and it's broken. Does not matter. Don't need it. I do have limited uh, inventory space, don't I? bit tragic, but we can work with this. Goo. Yeah, I guess we can go through. Yeah, I guess we can go through. I think combat will be a little easier as well once we get more more options for fighting. So, like, having a pistol, being able to, like, put turrets down and things like that will be very nice. Get fucked! 
Oh, those blow up and they hurt me. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. This is fine, this is fine. Let me harvest the plants. These are mine now. Also, can I eat some food? I think I want to save all of our, uh... Oh, that person just got spaced. Oh, the airlock, they go. Um, I want to save, like, our, our proper health kits and everything like that for gobs of damage for, like, big fights that we're doing. Whereas I'll just, like, use our food for basic healing. For some of these, like, smaller fights. Mm. Is a phantom talking? They talk? Oh, there's a corrupted whatever. Oh, this is horrible. What if I were to... Hold on, we gotta make our suit be better. Cause I'm doing it bad when it comes to our suit right now. Give me that neuro mod. Where is my menu for upgrading those, by the way? There it is. I have four neuro mods at the moment, which is pretty nice. 150% for med kits would be pretty cool. Although, give me that. I would like reduced, <laughs> reduced stamina cost for wrench attacks. Um, and we'll do leverage, and then we'll do the repair option next. Uh, sneaking might be nice, too. God, I want all of them. I would like all of the... <laughs> all of the upgrades, please. Where'd it go? Okay. Okay. Okay, this is fine. Um, oh, also, if I can do... Do that down. Okay. There we go. Thaddeus York! Whoa! Let me in! Clive Lawrence! What's wrong with you? I have I have fallen down. And there's no way for me to get back up. <laughs> so that's unfortunate. That's cool. I will I like this. Blue gun? Very nice. Also, I have a second wrench? EMP charge? It's a large burst of electromagnetic energy, highly effective against robots, turrets, and other electrical-based entities. Makes sense. Probably could be good against those corrupted security bots. Right? 
spare parts. Okay, well. Give me up out of there. Give me out of there. Give me those. Can I eat some of that? <laughs> I would like to not be as hurt as I am. Wow! Wow! I do- I like this. I'm- I am a fan of this so far. Um. <laughs> even with the, the problems we had with the controller and setting that up. That was an issue with, with Steam, or not Steam, uh, with Epic, not the game itself. So this is fine. Turret, turret where? Turret where? Yeah, that's just, that's, like I said, that's, that's an issue with Epic and not the game itself. So, <laughs> turret, it keep keeps showing me that there's a turret somewhere. There? Turret, please. I want you. But I do really like this. I still might mess around with the epic version and just like try remapping controls because I felt like I was a little more accurate with mouse and keyboard. Um, But even with that, I like it. Um, I will get lost a lot, <laughs> and uh, you will see me struggle a lot, but that's okay. I don't have an issue doing that, as long as you don't have an issue watching it. And if you do, well, that's on you. I don't know what to tell you then. Get me in there. No, I don't want to go back to the lobby. How do I get there? Can I get up there? What if I... I need to start remembering to use the hotkeys. Hmm. Hmm. Welcome back, Emmy. How do I get up there? How do I get up there? Can I go this way? Can we unlock this? I don't have a matching key card. It's glue! It's not rocks, it's glue! I can shoot glue! Ammo. Weapon upgrade. Programmable weapon modification device. Combine this item with a weapon to upgrade it. I don't have... Okay, hold on. Let's... Let's do that. No. There we go. Now put that in there. Okay, this is gonna be rough. <laughs> Managing my inventory. Because it is full at the moment. Uh, download that area map. Let's go. But yeah, it's my glue gun. Oof. Okay, this is fine. Reset checkpoint. Unlock security locker. Crew. Find Hope Ellis. If there's a check mark, does that mean that they're probably alive? <laughs> Wait, is this letting me mark? Oh. 
this is just letting me okay it's just up updating my thing i don't know that it's gonna like keep it in nope that's okay I, I understand what this is supposed to do. It's like if I find a note saying that so-and-so has this thing on on them, I can mark them and, and find them that way. Okay. I understand. It's gonna it's gonna be dinging for a little bit. Because <laughs> I decided to click on everything. I, okay, I understand that that's limited to people who have access um okay hold on before we do anything that's all how do i get in there how do we get in there didn't go anywhere that I could access in there from, so maybe we can get there from... I just wanted my map. <laughs> um. <laughs> Take care of yourself, stars! I hope your brain becomes less brain no so no mo. So no mo? Brain so no? Um, yeah, take care of yourself. Thanks for being here for a little bit. <laughs> we'll see you later, friends. Um. Ooh. No more brain. No more brain. <laughs> All good. I am... Incredibly tired. Wait, this is where we. Okay, this is where we came from. So. I need to go back in. That's fine. We just need to go back in. Yeah, I'll go back into the lab. Please and thank you. to mark off these <laughs> these codes that I wrote down that I don't need to write down. Okay, so we need to find we'll probably find some more key cards, right? So we can get through places. Or figure out who has key cards. Hmm. I want to get up there, so how do I do that? I don't have enough leverage to do this. This is tragic. I don't like that this doesn't stick to everything. Director Thorstein's I don't have a I don't have a code for him. How do we get up? Ha! Like that. Okay, you know what? Let's solve this issue. Then where are you shooting? <laughs> I forget that my jump is like as large <laughs> as it is. Cause I forget to hold it down. Okay. Look, I got up here twice before. There we go. There we go. Why does this phantom talk? Why do they talk? Why are they talking? This is what I meant to 
do. I am scared. I am scared. What if I don't fight it? <laughs> Consider. We don't do that? Oh, give me the glue canister. Looking with cauliflower. Okay, no, I think I think we have to can't get through. <laughs> I have to make noise to get through. move that it's doing stop Final signs critical. Uh. Ah! phantoms hurt phantoms hit hard and there's a regular mimic i'm gonna die before i get a chance to do anything oh. a lot of the station tech starts here Lab equipment, special parts requests, prototypes. We should be able to fix your looking glass terminal from Dr. Calvino's workshop. Okay, well, we can do that in a minute, all right? Uh, can I <laughs> put some garbage in here? What don't I need? What are these? Um, you know what? We can probably get plants fairly easily. So we'll put those away. I don't want to necessarily get rid of all of our, like, scraps and stuff. Unless... Yeah. Alcohol cures our health, or fixes our health by one, but cures fear. I don't think we need these. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we can, like, use flowers and stuff for crafting later. But I have picked up just a bunch of trash, so we should probably get rid of a lot of it. Um, oh, this gives me- I have to, like, deconstruct it, I understand. Um... Yeah, I didn't know I could, I could, is the thing. Because I'm still learning the game. Uh, this is fine. We'll be able to pick up garbage. Like, whenever. <laughs> Are they trying to break in here? Please don't. Um. Where does this go? Where do you go? Hi. You, you fool! I saw you! <laughs> I saw you change! It's okay, we'll be able to collect trash later. But, uh, for now... We'll just... We'll just get rid of some of our trash. Requesting new operator. What does this do? Transtar Pyramid 490 Medical Class Operator ready to deploy. Diagnosing bruising, abrasions, fatigue. Are you gonna fix me? Try to relax. What is new? Please fill out a patient experience questionnaire so I can serve you better next time. I love Medical Operator. He just healed me all the way. Also, I can do a shrimp check and a hydrate. I'm not really slouching right now. But I'll drink some water. Reminder for y'all to also drink some water. Check your posture. Make sure you're not... No shrimping. None shrimping. Okay, can we... Get through here? That side of the lab was breached. Hard vacuum. No gravity. 
There's an exterior airlock in the machine shop you could use to reach him. You'll have to upgrade your suit with a propulsion system first. I would like to get in there because there's a card. Listen, I want I want to go to there. <gasps> Give me that. Give me I'm stuck. Okay. We love Robo Friends. Handled. Well, he's not really a man, is he? But also, I can hit the wrong button. Where'd he go? There it is. Got him! Easy peasy. I'm not even worried. Look at us go. We're doing the thing. <laughs> Why? Okay. Um. Not another phantom. Have we read these. Thaddeus, please keep an eye on Franklin. The man spends far too much time on personal projects and recreational pursuits. We're all human here. We get it. But I'm worried he may try to use the propulsion system to access unauthorized areas. Hey, this is Gus down in Cargo Bay. I found something curious in an outbound container in my shift. I think it's a fabricator plan for an autonomous turret. It was stashed with a bunch of old ca uh, capacitor cells slated for delivery for the uh, Pythias facility. It might have been an accident, but I don't know. One of the officers put it in a safe in the life support system security or station. If you want it back, talk to them. I think I have the code for that? Thaddeus! Dr. Calvino isn't feeling well enough to present the latest looking glass tech to our visitors, so I'll be away from the labs for an extended period. I've left everything in working order while I'm out, but just in case, I'm sending you the key code to my office. It's 5679. I know where his office is? Is this it? No. I know we've seen his office here, though. <gasps> I have renewed... Renewed ability to do everything. Oh, this is his office. Thank you, Lily. Five, six, seven, nine. Get in there. Oh! Ah! <laughs> Thornston, please! That's a phantom! I think that's the director of the lab. Hmm. I have the sense he resented you. I'm it's it's fine! <laughs> it's fine! We, we fixed it! Right, bye, Jorgen. It was nice working with you. Oh, little picture. He had a family. And now they're short one dad. I read that as my new <laughs> role player. Um, it's Reployer. Dr. Thorsten, I just wanted to write your per you personally and thank you for the new Reployer. I know some people have been on wait waiting lists to get one of these, and it was a pleasant surprise to find a new one in my office this morning. It is this feeling of gratitude that makes it awkward for me to trouble you further. However, if you would spare, if you could spare one of your engineers for a bit, it would be great if they could swing by and show me exactly what it does. Thanks, Dr. Igwe. Part requisition. Wanted to clear a Morgan request again. Morgan was down in hardware today, just standing there as if not sure where to go. And when I offered to help, Morgan asked for more operator parts. I asked, the last, I asked if the last ones we'd sent hadn't been sufficient and I got a blank look. I mean, no offense, but Morgan's requ uh, requisitioned... Enough to repair any operator in the station five times over now. And we have other operators that need maintenance. Um, maybe I go back to where our buddy, our robo buddy was. So I can heal up. I do have two. You know what? No, it's fine. We have two of these. I can use one. 
I'd still like to go see our friends, but person safe. I don't have a code for this yet. Um, I need to remember to like check all of the things that we can read, even if I don't actually read all of them. So we can get codes. <laughs> Rude. Rude, rude. Rude, rude, rude. Rude, rude. Incredibly rude. Oh, no. This is slowly but surely healing me up. It has made me drunk, though. Okay, well... That's fine, I'm sure. We're not too worried about it. I think I've already read that one. Um, it's fine. We're drunk on the job. I wouldn't be worried about it too much. You know? Some sometimes you gotta let loose. Please don't drink on the job. I <laughs> I should should say I don't mean that. It is a joke. Okay, how am I supposed to go where they want me to go? Let's go back up here. For now. I would like to get into the safe. There we go. Get out of here, Mimic. Read that. That's nothing. Maybe. Maybe we go back this way. <laughs> is whoa there is okay I heard it I saw it downstairs that's where the breach is Maybe we go into Med Bay. Hello, are you here for an appointment? Diagnosing. Looks Fix like me. Day. I'll have you feeling better. Good as new. Please Thanks. fill out a patient experience questionnaire so I can serve you better next time. fine. Man just hits real hard. <gasps> Welcome back, Cyril. Robot friends! Can you just... Yes! <laughs> I've had to do a very weird fix to get the controller to work. Um, and by a weird fix, I mean I've had to port the game that I have on Epic through Steam in order to play game. So, you know... That's fine, but it is much better now. Um, so that's great. That's fine. Why do I have so many of these? Maybe we go back to our office real quick. Maybe I just find a recycler somewhere. This is ridiculous. <gasps> oh, I already got 
got in where where I was trying to go into. I see. This is fine. Let's clear out our inventory a little bit, and then I think we'll probably end a little early. Um, I need some food. I haven't eaten in a little bit. It's just hit me that I haven't. <laughs> um, but yeah, I might putz around with this a little bit. This is horrible. It's broken. Um, I will probably mess around with this a little bit uh, off stream to see if I like the controller a little better than the keyboard. I have to get more water. I'm a lot of water. Don't let me dehydrate too much. <laughs> Oof. Um. But yeah, I'll mess with it off stream. See if I like controller or mouse or keyboard better after uh, rebinding some keys. I like the controller, but it's just again, like I feel like I'm not as precise as I am with the oh, excuse me oh as precise as I am with, <laughs> with the mouse and keyboard which is fine is it following me yeah it's it's trying to at least this is a problem um but I am enjoying this so far weird it's cool whoa <laughs> Oh, that's not good. I don't remember how to get to my office. I poured my water and I didn't actually drink it. Yeah, I didn't realize there was a hole in the floor. We're just making our legs crunch a little bit. It's fine. Don't, don't worry about it. I'm sure it's fine. Just a tiny little crunch. We are a touch crunchy. I wouldn't worry about it. Ah! Okay. <gasps> Am I a taco shell? Am I crunchy? I wouldn't mind being a crunchy taco. I like crunchy tacos. What if I just run away from everything for a hot second? This is not the office that I wish to be in. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I got stuck! That's okay. This can be a future us problem. Um... it saved us pretty pretty early or not too long ago so like i said we're gonna end just like a just a touch early um but we will be back with this on exiting out of the game hold on uh we'll be back with this on on wednesday do some more on wednesday uh and hopefully i'll figure out which which play style i like better <laughs> after i do some remapping and gunk um, but yeah, that's all I've got for today. I need to go get some dang food. Shall we set up a raid? What do we have online right now? Loads of people. I'm gonna get good snack. It's gonna, it's gonna be such good snack. It's gonna be great. Um, okay, it looks like we've got ATM Zero doing some Dying Light 2. Toadsworthy doing some Fortnite. Mrs. Kiwi is doing some uh, VHS. 
Uh, thought level is doing some Mega Man 7. Any of these sound good? We haven't seen Miss Kiwi in a hot minute. <gasps> we can go say hi to ATM, though. Let's go say hi to ATM. <laughs> Cyril has spoken. All right. There are... Are our raid messages? The first one is for anyone that's got global emotes on it. Second one is for our sub. It's got our personal channel emotes on them. Um, like I said, we'll be back on on Wednesday with more prey. I like this. I do like this. I just need to figure out a better way for me to play it. <laughs> but yeah, I will see y'all later. Have a good rest of your day. And uh yeah. Hi friends.